Okay, so Instagram roundup time. Found some food stories that are not that serious. You're gonna enjoy them. When I saw them, I chuckled to myself a little bit more than I should have. Hope you enjoy them. Here's my top three Instagram stories. Dun, 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 dun. First story. A couple of days ago, Beyonce posted a flurry of Instagram photos, which you will see right here. And one of the photos is her ordering food. But of course, the internet exploded with memes, and these were some of my favorites. That moment when the waitress forgets to take off that $20 Groupon code for two meals. Hasn't that always happened to us? I know that happens to us a lot. Using the Groupon, can't avoid it. Okay, I don't know who ordered the gratuity. Yeah, that, I'm sure that's gonna be high. I actually invented lemonade, so it should be free. Oh, very clever, Blaria. Very clever, I like it. Here we go with another food trend. Cotton candy with soft serve ice cream and all of the junk food toppings that you could possibly imagine. If you were to think about this as a kid, you would probably dream this up. The first one we're looking at here is from Milk Train in London. They obviously have the market cornered with the cotton candy soft serve ice cream phenomenon. And then next, we have Room for Dessert by Casa Verde, which is actually in the Philippines. Again, same concept, maybe a little bit less whimsical with the colors and flavors of soft serve. Same concept, it just, it, it looks, it looks insane. Very similar to the video that I did about the unicorn latte and now everything exploded unicorn latte. Coincidence? Get a thing I don't know. Gotta think about that one. Last one for Instagram Roundup today. I kind of cheated a little bit on this one because I didn't technically find this story on Instagram, but I just love Queen Elizabeth II so much. I just, I think she's, oh, adorable. So, what you're looking at is pictures of Queen Elizabeth. She's adorable. She's 91. She must have the secret to longevity, but apparently, according to one of her former baker's um, servant, butler person, she every day before she goes to bed has a piece of chocolate biscuit cake. She knows, she knows what's up. Chocolate biscuit cake every night. She cannot go without this specific cake. And to me, that just, that just makes me love her so much more. I don't know, I just think she's so adorable and she just looks so put together and she's just I love her thing. And now that I know that she eats chocolate cake before she goes to bed, I think that she is the bomb.com. Because I do the same thing. Yes, I do. True story. There it is. Those are my top three Instagram roundup stories. I hope they put a smile on your face. You, the awesome person who is watching this video. And by the way, did you give this a video a thumbs up? If you did, I would greatly appreciate it. Also, you could subscribe to the channel. If you enjoy these videos, want me to continue making videos, that would be amazing as well. Hit the subscribe button and you will be the first to know about all the uploads. VEDA, which is vlog every day in April, is almost coming to a close. of one day left! One day! So this is actually episode... This is episode 30, actually, because I started one day before April 1st, so this is episode 30. Um, so tomorrow will be episode 31. Tomorrow is the big, I did 31 videos in 31 days. Sounds insane, and it actually taught me a lot of valuable lessons, and it was very insane, but very enlightening, and I met so many cool people along the way, which is really exciting to me. But I get to meet all of you, which is even better. So, uh, tune in for tomorrow for the 31st video in this 31 day straight marathon of this channel. So, I thank you. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you tomorrow.